Well, hey guys, what is up? It's Patrick from One Life Journey, and here's today's tiny house update. All right, so as I showed you last time, it's only been a few days since the last update, um, but quite a bit has been done. Uh, actually, well, quite a few little things have been done. Uh, you can see over here on the right side, we have the range hood installed. Um, we had to cut the top. This is actually an IKEA model. Cost about 600 bucks, uh, but it looks pretty nice. Stainless steel. It's actually the only thing in the house so far that has any kind of contrast to it. Uh, top had to be cut to con fit the contour of the ceiling. Up here on the ceiling, we're still doing a little bit of finish work. Uh, you can see we been filling all of the nails hole, nail holes here and uh, we're going to give it a quick coat of paint uh, just to make everything nice and smooth. Over the bed here you can see something's been installed. We have skylights and all the trim work that goes with it. Um, so yesterday we uh, had the roofers come in and start installing, start yesterday, finish today installing the roofing and the skylights and uh, we trimmed them out just after they put them in. Over here on the other side, kind of hard to see because of the light, you can see there is a skylight up there and it's all trimmed out. We're doing the same thing with the ceilings, uh, giving them a quick putty job and uh, repaint here to fill, fill all the nail holes. You can see the LED light is still there and we figured this one's the only one that's really still working so we're just going to let it stay. Underneath the loft here you can see that uh, the painter has been here and well, he actually finished up yesterday. Had about three and a half days of total uh, paint work here. Got everything white, uh, including the underneath of the uh, loft here. And you can see above the loft, I think, um, that the floor is white. Uh, we got a whole bunch of footprints on it from installing the trim work for the skylight. So we're going to have to clean that off and give it a touch up. Here in the shower, everything's pretty much the same. We did get a light installed. Oh, wrong one. There we go. Lights installed. The only reason the aluminum foil tape is there uh, is to hide the uh, dark joints. It's the same reason we used caulking in all the corners, uh, just to hide all the dark joints. Um, so when we put up the cultured marble, um, it doesn't show through. And here's some of the scraps from the roofer, and I'll show you the roof in a second here. Um, something neat that I didn't show you last time was they have this uh, neat exterior door that they um, we hadn't we installed uh, it's keyed. It's got a lock on it I don't think I'll be able to do this one-handed. So let me see if I can open her up and I'll get back to you Okay And it's insulated keeps all the heat in which is nice And underneath here we have a nice storage area for a whole bunch of whatever Christmas ornaments anything you can think of Nice that it's accessible from the outside Flipping back to this side, you can see we got all of the exterior siding done. Looks real nice. Got that. We had to order a few extra pieces. We ran a little bit short. Uh, and since this is custom made siding, it had to be ordered from a little bit further north in California. It had to be picked up and brought back down here. Here you can kind of see the roof a little bit. Let's go up and take a closer look. All right, so here's a good shot of the roof itself. You can see we had to poke uh, a hole in the roof for the uh, kitchen fan there, for the vent fan. But it's a beautiful um, steel roof, professionally installed. Coming over here, you can see the other skylight, all the flashing that goes with it, and the vent tube for the bathroom. But they did a great job. And I tried to watch as much as I could of what they were doing so that whenever it comes time for me to build something, I'll uh, maybe know a little bit more about how to do it. Well, anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. Until next time. Later.